High English. Part One. Unit One. Step One. Take One. Which highway should I take to get to Seattle? Let's take the ramp out after the next intersection. I'll take a taxi to the airport tomorrow. It's better to take the subway to make it for the appointment. Please take a right turn after the hospital. Every vehicle was advised to take a detour due to an auto crash on Highway 99E. A lot of people take the stairs for exercise these days. It may take long to wait for the elevator. Why don't we take the escalator? Step two. Dialogue. At the Heathrow Airport, I took the underground to Gloucester Street. What's the underground like? Well, the London Tube is the oldest subway system, and there aren't many escalators or elevators. Oh, weren't you carrying a big suitcase with you? Yeah, I had to take the stairs. It was a nightmare. Didn't anyone offer to help? Actually, a man did help when I asked. He carried my suitcase all the way to the ground floor. Unit two. Step one. Take two. Taking notes is a good strategy for longer listening questions in TOEFL. It's your turn to take minutes at the next meeting. I'm taking seven classes this semester. Giving advice is no use unless the other party takes it. The doctor told me to take two pills every day. Taking less carbs helps you to lose some weight. Could you take a few steps aside? It's already too late to take measures to curb the spread of the virus. Step two, dialogue. Dan refused to take the doctor's advice to stop smoking and get exercise. How did he quit smoking and get back in shape? We decided to get a dog. It changed him. Dan had to walk our dog Spot at least three times a week. It was a good exercise for him too. And as he grew to care about Spot, he was able to quit smoking. Wow, a little dog has been a blessing to you and Dan. Indeed, I'm even taking a knitting class to make some clothes for Spot. Unit three, step one, break. The German athlete broke the record for the high jump. Lisa mercilessly broke his heart. You should face the consequences of your actions when you break all the rules. Karen broke the law when she drove the wrong way on a one-way street. After he broke his arm, he was home for weeks. He said, "Break a leg" to me before I went on to the stage. Sherlock had to break the code on Irene's phone. Lisa's family members waited several days until her condition improved to break the news that her parents had been killed in the accident. Step two, dialogue. I was so nervous when I gave my first speech. It took me some time to learn how to break the ice. I can't picture you as a novice speaker. You are so good. Everyone starts somewhere. I've been there too. Any tips on how to break the ice? Well, throwing a good question is one good way to start, especially with one that breaks the mold. Such as. Like, did you know women's average lifespan was shorter than men's before the twentieth century? Unit four. Step one. Make one. Later, the guide made a comment that the crash had not been an accident. The researcher made an inquiry on the documents related to the old experiment. Have you ever made a promise to someone and purposely did not keep it? He clearly made the point he was going to fire Michael. 
Sarah is always making complaints about how people are treating her. I made a suggestion at the staff meeting, and most people thought it wasn't a good idea. Nobody knows what noise a fox makes. The kidnapper made brief calls from telephone booths to avoid being tracked by police. Step 2. Dialogue Have you ever made an inquiry to the game company about the bug? Yeah, I did. But their technician said the problem was with my internet connection. It doesn't make sense. Don't you have the same glitch over and over? Yes. Maybe I should post about it on a social media instead of making a complaint to the company. That's a good idea. If it goes viral, they might make an apology and fix the bug. Unit 5 Step 1 Make 2 I enjoy making coffee in the morning and drinking it while it's hot and tasty. He had to chew on some jerky because it was hard to make a fire in the rain. Didn't you and Laura make a promise not to fight in front of your children? I'd like to make a reservation for tonight at 7 p.m. Josh made good money from Bitcoin mining. Robert has never had a steady job, but he's always managed to make ends meet. His ex-wife's revelation didn't make a big difference to the sales of his book. Arthur liked to make believe that his father was the captain of a big ship. Step 2. Dialogue How do you make breakfast for seven children and your husband every morning? Well, it's not just breakfast. I also need to pack lunch bags for all eight of them. I can't just believe how you manage. Hmm, I like to make believe I am a chef in a restaurant. I make weekly meal plans and stick to them. But it's not just cooking you do for your family. I had my children make a promise to take turns doing household chores. What happens if they fail to keep it? Unit 6 Step 1. Make 3. DHL has made changes to its core delivery systems. We haven't made any headway with this project. Lisa made a dive for the fridge to quench her thirst. When Rose was not admitted into the club, she made a big scene and argued with the manager. The kids made a mess in the playroom but I made sure they put away all their toys. Eva made up her mind to change her diet. The subjects were asked to make a choice between saving the return in their account or donating it to charities. George gradually made a habit of stopping by Anne's office before he left for the day. Helen finally made peace with her mother at her mother's deathbed. Step 2. Dialogue An old man made a big scene at my checkout counter yesterday. Oh my, that sounds tough. What was his issue? He complained that the price of his favorite chips had gone up. I don't know what he thought I could do about it. Oh, that doesn't make sense at all. Was he drunk? Yeah, I could smell alcohol on him. I wanted to call the police right away, but I had to report it to my manager first. That seems like an inefficient procedure. They should make some changes to those formalities. I agree, but they're the ones who make the decisions. Unit 7 Step 1 Do 1 Steve mowed lawns and did chores around the house for an allowance. Zoomers are doing grocery shopping for boomers during the pandemic. The Korean government did a great job in controlling COVID-19. It's not easy to do business with indigenous communities in South America. My doctor suggested that I meditate or do yoga. 
Carol is too busy doing her makeup to answer her phone, I guess. Don't be afraid. I'll do you no harm. The live action movie adaptation didn't do justice to its Webtoon original. Step 2 Dialogue Is the new guy doing well on your team? You mean Jeremy Hopkins? Well, he's doing a great job. He's quick to pick things up and does well with people. What makes you ask? You know, my team has a new hire, too. She's doing a good job as well, but. Are there any issues with her doing her tasks? It's just. She uses emojis a lot in the team chat room. It's a bit much for me. Am I just being a boomer about this? Probably. Emojis never did harm, right? It's about us doing the adjusting to the younger generation, not the other way around. Unit 8. Step 1. Do 2. I am a U.S. citizen. I did all the paperwork for my wife, but they denied her a visa. Economic sanctions against Russia are unlikely to do the trick. The actor hopes he did his part to help change the culture in Hollywood. I'll just do the best I can, and I am happy with that. Why don't you guys do someone a favor for once in your boring lives? When you ask someone a favor, the empathy instinct of a person gets activated. I have great faith in you. I know you'll do well. Let's do the math. If I was black, I would have sold half. Step 2 Dialogue I did the math, but I'm afraid the rent in San Francisco is way too high for me. You got a job there. Don't you need a place to live? I'm considering living in a van for a few years. Oh, like being unhoused? These days, they are converting vans into comfortable living spaces. There's a big community of van lifers on YouTube. It's a great way to save on rent. But can you cook or shower in a van? A lot of van lifers have cooking equipment, some even with full size ovens and fridges. And with a membership at a nationwide gym chain, you can easily shower there. So a converted van might really do the trick for you. Unit 9. Step 1. Save. Lockdown was not only a matter of saving lives, but also mitigating the workload of overcrowded hospitals. My friend Toad saved my skin when I was threatened with a knife. These kitchen gadgets will save your time and effort. Save your strength for things you can change. Fortunately, the goalkeeper saved a penalty from Lionel Messi. Their meal kit saved me a lot of troubles during the lockdown. My friend came earlier and saved a seat for me at the concert. Please save the date for the wedding of Matt and Katie. Step 2 Dialogue Is your school using an LMS? Don't get me started. We have two LMSs. One is the school's, and the other one is offered by a publisher. Plus, there is an electronic attendance system and a separate comprehensive management system. Aren't they supposed to save teachers time and effort? The thing is, most universities have added one system after another with new technology over the years. But instead of creating one integrated system, My school has me navigating between four different sites. It's a huge hassle. Hey, calm down. Save your strength for now. You should bring this up with the teachers' union so they can address it. Unit 10. Step 1. Have one. I have a mom, a dad, and a sister. In my family, there's my mom. My dad, my sister, and me. Sorry, but I have a boyfriend. I have a serious case of the flu. 
He has a bloodshot eye on one side. Are you going to have a party or family gathering? I have plans for tonight. Can we reschedule? The so called Aryan race, an imaginary race created by the Nazis, was believed to have blue eyes and blonde hair. I could see this young lady has an attitude. Step 2 Dialogue I want to have a family with you. Oh, where is this coming from? Haven't we discussed this before? Yes, we have. But my cousin recently had a baby. She looks so happy and seems to have settled down. You know, it's just that she appears happy. The responsibilities of raising a child can be more overwhelming than you think. Plus, I've been dealing with this back pain for years. I simply can't handle it with my conditions. All right, I get it. I'll take back what I said. It's just, sometimes I imagine us having a daughter. She'd have beautiful green eyes and brunette hair, just like you. And if she takes after me, she'll have a strong character, too. Isn't one of me enough for you? Unit 11. Step 1. Have 2. I had a good breakfast, so it's okay to have a late lunch. My grandmother always encourages me to have a bite to eat. As the chairman's son, Michael had an advantage over the rest of us. The mother had total control over her son, even though he was over 30. The Jamaican girl had a hard time adapting to the winter weather in Toronto. It is important to have some quality time with your family. Sorry, but we had no intention of offending you. I have no reservations about recommending Mr. Hills to your institute. Step 2 Dialogue So, how was your weekend? Very good. I had some quality time with my kids. Good for you. You guys deserve it. What did you do with them? We went to Lake Martin. Kids swam while I was reading by the lake. At night, we toasted marshmallows and had some over a campfire. Hmm, sounds like you really had a blast. Well, everything was perfect until. Until? Until my boss called me to ask about some figures in the Jameson report. Unit 12. Step 1. Catch. Which metal easily catches fire at room temperature? Grizzly bears catch salmon with their powerful claws or their jaws when salmon migrate upstream. Who caught your eye in BTS? Did you catch Jennifer Lawrence on The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon? At the sight of Laura, Eric caught his breath and gulped. I think I caught your cold. I'm lost. Maybe I'd better catch a taxi here. I'm sorry. I must go now. I have a train to catch. Step 2 Dialogue Back in the day, My grandfather showed me how to catch catfish with his bare hands. With his bare hands? Wow! Well, he did most of the fishing, and I would gather some dry tree branches as they easily catch fire. I still miss roasting fish over a campfire. That's a very special memory. Yeah, and the countless stars in the night sky were just overwhelming. I liked camping with my dad, too. Sometimes he took me and my brother deep into the woods in the winter. Camping in the winter sounds cool. My mom was worried we might catch a cold, but sleeping in a tent in the snow was a special experience that bonded me with my dad. Unit 13. Step 1. Get 1. I live in Ohio, but I got a speeding ticket in New Jersey while visiting family. Lisa finally got her admission letter from her dream college. Joseph got his engineering degree from Columbia and then spent 10 years working in IT. Ted got a job with a multi level marketing company. 
I sometimes got the impression that something was amiss between the couple. Amy finally got the opportunity to go to Paris and study art. Been there, done that, got the T-shirt. Could you please get me a cup of coffee on your way back to the office? Step two, dialogue. Wow, where did you get that dress? I bought it at Red or Dead last Saturday. Isn't that place expensive? It is, but I got a thirty percent off coupon from my cousin. Sounds like you got a good deal. Not really. I got a parking ticket while shopping there. Oh no! But the dress looks amazing on you. Let's go out. Thanks, Sarah. I needed a change. Unit fourteen. Step one. Get two. How do you get to work every day? In two thousand four, five young IT entrepreneurs got together and founded Good Tech. This book has golden tips for you to help your child to get ready for the first day in school. I'm not getting any younger. Robin is getting married next week. I got fired for missing two days in a month. Miami is a good place to get started. I'm starving. Can you get me something to eat? Step two, dialogue. Doesn't it take you two hours to get to work? It used to. It used to. You're not working for G Bank anymore. I got fired last week. Why? For tardiness. I kept showing up late. But you need a job, especially now that you're getting divorced. I know. There's just been too much going on in my life. It's been hard to concentrate on work. Unit fifteen, step one, pay. I have bills to pay, but I'm not happy at work. Andy paid a fine of three hundred dollars for a traffic violation. The factory pays wages on the fifteenth of each month via SH Bank cards. The businessman refused to pay ransom for his grandson. In his movie *Pulp Fiction*, Tarantino paid homage to the nineteen sixty-three Italian movie *Eight and a Half*. She paid lip service to blue-collar workers. But she did nothing to help them once elected. Anyone can pay a casual visit to this museum during any time of the year. Pay close attention to your gut instinct. Step two, dialogue. I'm not sure if I should buy a house. What's holding you back? I just don't want to be tied down to a mortgage for two decades. It feels like my whole life would be taken hostage. You should also consider rent hikes. Sometimes paying a mortgage can be more predictable than dealing with ever rising rents. Is there a way to live both debt free and rent free? Some countries like Australia have very good welfare systems, so their citizens don't have to worry about life after retirement. But they also pay a lot of taxes, right? Yes. But isn't it worth it for peace of mind? Unit sixteen, step one, go. Those who went overseas had better opportunities than at home. The twins went their separate ways and have become estranged. Everyone fell silent and everything went quiet. Kids can go wild on this jungle gym. Bell ultimately went out of business completely and closed all eighty of its stores nationwide. The share price has nearly halved since the company went public. They would have a beer or go bowling on weekends. In that city, you can go dancing all night long. Step two, dialogue. I feel very lost, like I'm going crazy. Oh, Nat, just forget about Brad. You just have to move on. I know I should, but my feelings say otherwise. 
How about we go dancing tonight? I've heard the new club Scream is the place to be. What if Brad is there too? You know he enjoys clubbing. Well, let him see you thriving without him. We can have a blast without boyfriends. What's the point in pretending I'm okay? Sometimes pretending to be doing well actually helps you feel better. Unit 17. Step 1. Come. The hurricane came ashore along the Texas Gulf Coast last Saturday. Joseph sacrificed everything for the cause. To him, everything, even his own family, came second. In the boy's dream, all his toys came to life. The military operation came to an end on September 7, 1992. Gradually, she came to realize that his words were all lies. You will come to understand that your child is not your property. The company eventually came clean and admitted they had made a mistake. My son doesn't want to study sound editing, but I think he will come around to the idea if he gives it some thought. Step 2. Dialogue Man, I came close to quitting my job today. Really? What happened? My boss tried to pin the error in the Jackson report on me. I was about to call him out when... When what? When his secretary, Kelly, came to my defense and said it was actually him who had made the wrong change to the final draft. Wow, she is an angel. Well, my boss has been harsh on her too, so I guess she's had enough of him. Your boss seems really difficult. Haven't there been any actions taken against him? Unit 18 Step 1 Keep King Herod had John beheaded to keep a promise to Salome. I was always the kid who kept my distance from everyone. Sam has given up drinking and taken up tennis to keep fit. If you keep calm and stick together as a team, you'll be all right. The best place to keep an iguana is in a terrarium. Kevin climbed a tree to keep watch. Taylor kept a log of the number of hours she spent bird watching. I really wish I had kept a journal during all my travels. Step 2. Dialogue I feel like I've been a bad mom to my son. Hey, don't be too hard on yourself. You've done enough as a single working mom. Maybe my best wasn't good enough for Noel. Last week, he told me how many times I had failed to keep my promises to him. What promises? Promises like taking him to Disneyland or letting him have a pet. Hmm. But you've worked long hours, juggling between work and study, and you've managed to stay healthy. I'm thinking about getting him a dog. I guess he's old enough to take care of one now. Good idea. Raising a dog will help him understand what it takes to take care of someone. Unit 19 Step 1. Bring This delicious chocolate cake brought a lot of happiness this Easter. Education can help to bring peace to the war-torn country. The employee decided to bring in action for infringement of personal rights. The investors brought a claim after not receiving their stock purchase rights. Police detained John Adams last weekend and brought him before a court. Russian authorities detained a Uzbek blogger, questioned him, and brought him before a judge. His actions brought shame on his parents. The scene brought tears to my eyes and warmth to my heart. Step 2. Dialogue I'm planning to bring my case before a court. Yeah, I guess you have to. Your company didn't take the proper actions. They refused to relocate the assailant. Instead, they are buying his claim that he was falsely accused. Any grounds for that? They say there's no evidence besides my word. 
Oh, come on. In sexual harassment cases, the victim's testimony alone can be enough evidence. I know. But the management is mostly men, and it seems like they think the shame brought upon the assailant is graver than the suffering I've gone through. Shame. Jeez. He brought that shame on himself. Unit 20. Step 1. Give. Yesterday, I gave him a call to find out more about the offer. Today, my crush gave me a ride home. He even opened the door for me when I got out. When I left the company, I gave my employer three months' notice. At the workshop, they asked me to give some examples of different marketing techniques. I gave a lecture on qualitative research to medical students last month. Callahan gave a presentation on virtual reality. Steve's teenage son gave him a hard time by refusing to get out of bed and prepare for school. Injuries sustained during World War II gave rise to advancements in modern plastic surgery. Step 2. Dialogue Sadie asked me to help her with her campaign, but I don't feel like doing it. I've been there. I wouldn't work with her either. The thing is, if she wants someone to help her, at least she should know where she needs help. I can give her a hand, but... She basically wants others to do all the work for her. Last time I worked with her for a fundraiser, I ended up doing almost everything. I even cleaned up the booth by myself. Wow, what did Sadie do then? She did interviews with local newspapers and talked to the mayor. That's all she did. Someone should give her a heads up about the way she works if the campaign is to go on. Well, who would tell her to her face? Unit 21 Step 1. Put to put it bluntly, the poor are getting poorer, while the rich are getting richer. I had to deliver some bad news to my clients. How can I put it tactfully so they won't get upset? The city council has put in a bid for some government funding. I decided to put in a request for Australian citizenship. Her family put great pressure on Alice to marry the rich man. The government refused to put limits on greenhouse gas emissions. That statement, simply put, means Beijing might actually invade Taiwan. Very well put, Mr. Gibbons. Now, can you give us some practical examples? Step 2. Dialogue Amy, is the Maxwell Project going well? Hmm, I'm afraid not. How so? To put it bluntly, the officials in the government seem to ask for some bribes. I heard business culture is quite different in that country, so I kind of saw it coming. What should we do? I suggested to the management that we abort the project. Well put, Amy. It's their government's loss if the project goes to naught. I hope this case will put some pressure on the government to change their bad practices.